Hey there, welcome to another Call of Cthulhu stream with us, the Masters of Boredom. I am Pantsasaren, and above me you can see CJ. Hello, everyone. And above him you can see our Game Master, Augie. Look at him at the top there. The man who will ultimately be responsible for our deaths. No question. You'll only have yourselves to blame. Oh, oh, I, I and, you, to and you. And you. I fully me. intend on blaming and you me. quite a bit. And me. So. But mostly you. <laughs> So, how the heck are you? Uh, we were, uh, we had just explored, uh, this was, uh, it's three weeks ago, so uh, let's catch you back up. Um, we had recently explored this mansion. Right. And, so, where uh, we left off, if you want yeah. me to take it, because I have yeah. uh, uh, should we want... Should we level up first, or should we do the catch up first? Does it really it... matter? doesn't really matter let's do the catch up first real okay. quick so for those who missed it or for those who uh can't remember it because it has been a oop that one you probably didn't hear it but my phone just like went nuts no uh, I didn't, didn't hear a thing i was busy I was busy waving hi to harley quinn who said hi in the chat fair enough uh so uh last time uh you guys were exploring the seaside mansion uh, you had discovered a strange tunnel, hidden tunnel, uh, in its ma in its basement mm. that led to a bunker of sorts that had a very eldritch uh, statue hidden away in one of its chambers. Mm -hmm. Upon further exploration of the mansion, and against probably your better judgment... You had returned back to the said statue to attempt to uh, find out what it's hiding. And in it, you found a key, a key to the lighthouse, as you had discovered in one of the mansion's offices. Mm -hmm. Thankfully, it had a tag on it that said, this key goes to the lighthouse. Yes, very, very efficient. Yeah. That's the straightforward explanation of what happened last time. There were some things in between, including... Uh, a piano lesson with a ghost girl that uh, yes. Obadiah had learned how to play piano uh, to some degree because of it, um, as well as a strange uh, retrospective uh, scenario, ghostly scenario took place in the main hall as they had watched uh, two individuals, one of which being the ghost girl, being shot by a... a old British colonial soldier. It's not right, man. It's not right. Yeah, well, hey, moving things on. were different back then. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> things were different back then. And, you know, old men killed uh, young children all the time. It what? was standard. It was, it was very standard. What? What are we talking what? about? Let's move on. Uh, so, uh, should we, uh, level up now before we get too far into our cups? Yeah, as it were? Uh, now, now would be a good time. I don't level. have a lot to level up because I don't think I achieved much. I don't need CJ's, uh, sheet. I'm going to level up my piano playing. <laughs> yeah. I will start with my German because it's, uh, it's on the far left and I need to roll higher than yeah. 28. I like good my luck. odds, but I also, uh, know how well these dice love to, uh, yeah. Over. As always, the blue is the tens and the black is the ones. Twenty-seven. I couldn't make that up if I tried. Uh, save that for the roll rolls. Can I? Can I spend one of my nineteen remaining luck to make that twenty-eight? <laughs> or is that a dumb idea? I only have 19 a, left. That would, be, that would be a dumb idea. <laughs> oh, man. I really wanted more German. It's, it's all right. We'll, all we'll right. have plenty of time to practice. Well, library use is a 40. I don't, I re, after failing on a 28 with a 27, I really don't like my odds of getting a 40. Uh, I got a 61. I got a 61. So I am going to improve my library use by probably one point. That's okay. Nine! Oh, 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 oh. oh goodness. Very good. Very good. I got Look really at good at my library use. Oh, I should get rid of the tick on German as well. Uh, okay, next is listen. How good I am at listening. Uh, 32 what? to beat. What? 
32. What? Yeah. 67. Very nice. All right. Let's see how much well increases. Done, Bye. Big bucks, no whammies. That's a two. Oh, I wanted that to be an eight so bad. Uh, it was close. It was close, but no cigar. No, but sorry. it is an improvement. Uh, and lastly, spot hidden, the thing we are more desperate than anything to improve, I think. <laughs> uh, yeah. 39. Uh, 41, just barely. Very nice. And can we get a big increase? Nope, it's another two. It's another two. At least you broke 40. Why bother? Over to CJ. Hopefully He's you have better luck than I, sir. He says, why bother? But trust me, every point helps. <laughs> every point. Yeah. That, that's... yeah. Statistically, it becomes more and more in your favor every being, time you go. Being able, being able to speak well in German will save me from the tentacle that is squeezing me to death, I'm sure. Um, yeah. I mean, that might be what the safe word is in German. You don't know. <laughs> <laughs> you do the safe word in German. I couldn't scr shingle him anymore. Yeah. I don't know what to tell you. All, All right. right. I guess I'll start with my, my German. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Come on, Let's CJ. See. Come on. Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm confident. Big Knox Pedro. Oh, look oh, yeah. at that. 88. Yeah. Perfect. All right. So okay, uh, see we'll uh, do the tens digit to find out how much up to 10. Two. There is two. That, That's okay. That, That's that, about all the German uh, these, I deserve to learn. These dice, man. I swear to God. Right? There it is. Boopity, boopity. Okay. Yep. All right. Next um, is listen. What? Uh, all right, I I really need listen to get what? better. I did I did awful last time. That joke has gotten so old. Uh, sixty two is a pass, so go ahead and get yourself some big points. Come on. Uh, hey, that's better. Here. That's better. Six points. Well done. Yeah. yeah up your right. listen to forty two. Yeah. Ba ba ba. All Very right. Nice. Not and bad. Spot hidden. Get it up uh, yeah. higher than I did, please. Uh -huh. Come on, 10. I'm asking for a 10. You need a 40 just to get on. Yep, you got it. 84 okay. will do it. And come on, 10. Come on, 10. One. <laughs> of course. So you are now on of par course. with with Ark with Spy Hit. Uh, okay. All right. Well, that's all right. We needed that. We needed those numbers. Every little bit helps. Because what if you roll a okay. 40? Mm. That's right. All right. So, um,. So Back what you're to saying the... is there's a one in a hundred chance of that actually yeah. helping. <laughs> yeah. Yep. All right. right. Let's carry Just on. All right. Okay. So we, where were we? Are you were in the main hall? You were just leaving uh, the bunker into out of the basement and into the main hall over here. You don't have to. You don't have to bring him over here. We already got. We already got guys here. For the primary were you purpose. trying to oh, parkour him over the wall? <laughs> yeah, I was. No, no. <laughs> we can get him up. Oh, man down, man down. I'm messing up my thing. Anyways, All right. All right. anyway, so you got your guys right here. Okay. So yes, you are back in the main lobby. It okay. is uh pretty early in the morning, probably around four or five o'clock. You can start okay. to see the sun rise, like a little bit of the sunrise starting to come up. Hooray for daylight. Hooray for daylight. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. What are, What is your action now? Are you going to move through the mansion? Are you going to take a one last cursory look? Or are you going to head for the exit? I was thinking about hiding in this bureau here. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I guess I guess I the... think I think I need to take a leak. <laughs> okay. I've been trapped in um, here for a long time. We have been here for a while. And there um, are no bathrooms anywhere. You notice that? Yeah. Well, listen, listen. Fancy people piss out windows. I mean, it's... I guess. All right. Well, um, there there should be windows now. Yeah, they they have chamber pots. So if not a door. All right. Well, you take point, and I will uh, I will cautiously walk behind you, covering our backside. Okay. Other than hey, the, wait a minute. am I wearing my shirt with the bullseye on it again? Yes. Damn yes. it! You take it everywhere. You never take it off. Curse this fashion sense of mine. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Do, 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 why? Do. Why is this shirt red? <laughs> so outside of the creaking of the floorboards and the regular settling of the of the building itself uh you don't hear anything out of the ordinary in fact you hear the clicking of a grandfather clock somewhere 
Hmm. Ark, I do believe whatever is transpiring here has passed. I hope so. As do I. But I wonder why the ghosts wanted us to know those uh, those events. Maybe it was just the house telling us a story. To what? Lull us to sleep? Um, well, I didn't say it was a nice story. I'm <laughs> sure there was a purpose behind it. I am sure. If, if we've learned anything, it's to just leave. So let's go. Okay. <laughs> Agreed. I mean, tell me I'm wrong. Yeah. Yeah. Um, do you yeah. want to burn down the house? Or, I mean, should we leave it here? <laughs> uh, I mean, just... To, I guess we could just pack it into an altered dimension. That works too. That's you, yeah. To the bag of holding with it. So you open up a door and you can <laughs> see outside. Uh, it, Conrad it says that's the true horror. No toilets. No yep. toilets. No one goes to the bathroom. In my game. Read, but uh, read all the you know the uh, Cthulhu mythos Lovecraftian fiction you want. No bathrooms. No bathroom. Actually, <laughs> that's not true. I think I read one where there, it starts with a with a guy in the bathroom. Um, uh, just yes. Looking, yeah. look, looking at himself that. in the bathroom mirror as he's washing yeah. his face. I'm like, oh, yep. yeah, okay. So bathrooms was, do uh, exist in Lovecraft, but yeah, I think it was the rat one, actually. Yeah. Yep. Um, but you open up the door and you can see outside. It's a nice, cool East Coast day. Where the hell is the guy that dropped us off? Uh, you can actually see him coming up the path towards you. And he goes, oh, thank goodness. He goes, he goes, I took a step. I took one step outside to uh, <clears throat> have a cigarette and I couldn't get back in no matter how hard I tried. Interesting. Interesting. Yeah, we couldn't leave either. Because uh, he's like, what happened in there? I don't you know. know. Just, uh... It was weird. You know what? I've seen things like this before, like mass hallucinations. Um, yeah. We probably hit a bad pocket of swamp gas. Um, yeah. You know, somewhere yeah. nearby that just uh, got released uh, into the mansion and outside of it. And we might have all been experiencing some hallucinations there. But yeah. those of us inside, we, we could swear we couldn't get out. And you apparently couldn't get in. So it was, it was just I mean, plain it's, weird. It's very... And the, it gets and then, very humid this time of night, so maybe the doors were swollen. But we we slept it off, and you know, in the morning everything was fine. So yeah, yeah. And the door is yeah. here now, so it's definitely foul. no history murder. I guess. Yeah. He kind of just looks at you and then takes a cursory look at his uh, pack of cigarettes that seem to be kind of just in his pocket. And he goes, "Yeah, maybe it has something to do with that." And he goes, "Well, I'm glad that you guys are okay. I hope you enjoyed your." impromptu overnight tour how yeah, often do no, your uh, tour mean, guests have problems like as, this aside from that it was delightful i mean yeah. you know the building is, in, is still in very nice condition he goes oh yes yeah, yeah oh yeah it surprisingly for as long as it's been around it's it's held up pretty well hmm he looks goes, like it doesn't want to die or someone's keeping tabs on it making sure it's perfectly fine right right It'll who uh, who designed the the wine cellar uh it looks like it was someone's workstation uh or uh, experiment station was was, there... i i believe it was the original owner's uh little personal workstation gotcha uh, was he a bit of a scientist an inventor perhaps he was a doctor he was a physician actually uh an old dutch physician he uh a lot of dutch settlers came out this way and uh he had basically made this place his home. Interesting. What was, what was his name again? He goes, the name was Lost uh, in the records. We don't have. That's a strange of... name, Lost in the records. Old, old yeah. His name. Yeah, very strange name. Oh, uh, but I mean, it, it might be Dutch. It's it definitely sounds Dutch, Lost in the records, but. Uh, other than that, uh, dude, yeah, his name was just expunged from a lot of things. Uh, outside of just the history of the mansion itself, the person in question is a greater mystery, which is what makes the mansion so interesting, in my yeah. opinion. Who uh, were, were the records expunged by fire at like an accidental 
fire or, or... Was, that, that's that's um that's a bit unclear uh it's it almost seemed purposeful because like, I, like, I don't see why anyone would just want to delete themselves from existence, essentially. Uh, yeah. Unless there was a very good reason for it. Maybe, maybe they were w- running from their homeland? That, or maybe he was a homicidal maniac, or maybe they just didn't keep good tabs on people back then. Yeah. Because who's to say? I'm just glad we're not homicidal maniacs. Yep, definitely not murder hobos. No, no, definitely not. That's why you're still alive. Yeah. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> the chance of be there being two serial killers in one place is just statistically unlikely. Yeah. Three. 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 Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Three. 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 <laughs> he goes, well, uh, uh, I, like I said, I hope you enjoy it. I hope you come back again soon. Yeah, yeah. All right, uh, thanks for having us. Um, I guess we'll uh, head back towards town. What do you think there, Ark? Sure. Let's it's not too late it. to burn this motherfucker down. I, I know, but... Um... Okay. Later? Later? First we'll have ice cream, then we'll burn yeah, it down? Yeah, yeah. Well, I need to get some real sleep. I, I told them we slept, but we didn't actually sleep. So. We totally did not sleep. That's because we were busy being fucking terrified. Yeah, I'm exhausted, so... Okay. Let's go back to our hotel and sleep. Yes, indeedy. Oh, God. My God. All right. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> we, to, we go sleep at the hotel. We sleep on roof. Sleep at the hotel. Don't you have an apartment? <laughs> oh, yeah, we do have an apartment now. Yeah, duh. So well, you head back. Old, in, silly old, What's his name? Yeah, well. Yeah. So you head back in town. You're basically coming from... Uh, this direction over here okay so your your apartment is immediately right there uh the town is busy it's bustling it's uh officially tourist season and Ooh. uh they're setting up and getting ready for their big kind of like you know special fair seaside fair and everything like that like mm-hmm. you kind of see workers bringing like tents towards the beach and stuff like that uh they're just getting, but by the what you can tell is they're just getting started. Uh, but there are uh, quite a few crowds of people just kind of, you know, Ooh. ogling the oh the ocean, oh that's so beautiful, and then like shopping and just you know, doing what tour tourists do. I should I should go man the store. We could make some money, Ark. In this economy, <laughs> it's tourist season. This is like. 1920s is the best time. <laughs> yeah, right. It's the roaring 20s. We could tell we could tell Wendigo stories and stuff. Uh, I'm. You can do whatever you want. I'm going to bed. It's been a long day, and I just right. <laughs> selfish. Here, I'll sleep on the couch. All right, there. <laughs> Face down, ass up over. The- <laughs> <laughs> just, the, just the way I like to sleep. That's fine. I mean, if All you right. decide you want to, if you decide you want a spoon, I'll be in here. Was there uh, any additional uh, business that you wanted to take care of in town, or was there anything that you had requested from any of your contacts that you still are waiting on? Well, we had dropped the, the uh, medical manuscripts that we had attained off in Arkham, but I don't think it's time to go back there quite yet. We really, I mean, we could, I suppose we could relay the information we got, but I really don't trust telephoning anything anywhere. Um, Right, I was going to say, because there is a telephone if you wanted to contact them. I would like to compose a telegraph. Okay. You would like to compose a telegraph. Uh, What would you like to send? Um, I would like to convey our our experience uh, in in the city, in the obelisk. Uh, the unrelenting pull that even now as Ark sleeps, I'm secretly thinking of sneaking out of the apartment and spending more time with it. But no, go, I have to compose a statue for a little while. I have to compose a telegraph. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So uh, very simple to do. Um, go ahead and you can go ahead and do that in your free time. 
Okay. Uh, and you're I'm, you're sending it to the library, right? The Arkham Dude, library. Yeah, to Arkham, yeah. Okay. Uh, Ark, besides sleeping upon your uh, awakening, uh, do you have any other matters you wanted to take care of real quick? Just mundane or free action kind of stuff? Is there something I should be taking care of? It's entirely up to you. If there's anything that, like, uh, if nothing comes to mind, you're you're pretty much good to just rest your character back to whatever you were. Do we? Playing. I was gonna say, do we regain anything? I I don't think we've regained anything in a long time. Yeah, and my luck's running low. I'm getting <laughs> concerned. Right, I have to remember how to regain luck, but uh, I could meditate, try and get some sanity back. Okay. Yeah, if you want to go through while you're doing that in your rest, if you'd like to gain some sanity back, you're more than welcome to. Does that work the same way as leveling up, or no? It's different, isn't it? Uh, it's different. It's it depends. It's like a set amount depending on, uh, I believe you do, kind of thing. Uh, oh, I forgot you could so, push rolls. Actually, actually, if you wanted to, if you both want to roll a 1d10 real oh. quick. Uh-huh. I do. I don't know how you knew, but I do. Ha! Ah. I got a 3. Oh! I got an 8. Okay, that's how much luck you gain back. Oh. oh okay. That was easy enough. So regaining luck, I think is primarily a home rule so we'll do that after you if, whenever you rest or have a mm. moment of respite okay will allow you to try to regain some luck back okay i would like yeah. another moment of respite please <laughs> <laughs> um so how does sanity work do you know have you figured it out yet i think it's a i think you're supposed to long rest and i think you get uh, so looking through the rule book right now um Let's see. For the purpose of losing one fifth of your sanity per day. Uh, I forgot we could push rolls that that failed. Yeah. Um. Can't do it in <laughs> combat though. Th therapy is one one d three sanity per month. <laughs> oh, for <laughs> f's sake. No, but, um, but you can also uh, be rewarded plus one d ten sanity uh, based yeah. on uh, a successful scenario. I'd say what you did was pretty successful. So if you want to roll another d ten and add that to your sanity, I mean, we got out of a horror house. Uh, that's a ten. There you go. Got a boy. Finally, and I got another eight. Gotcha. Oh, good lord. Well done, sir. Your sanity mm. max is at nine, by the way. Uh, I thought it was ninety nine. Ninety nine, sorry. Yeah, that's what I meant. Um, I, I, actually, meant I, think... say, I meant to say ninety nine, but I stopped at nine. <laughs> actually, I my that. I think my sanity's already topped off. What? Did How? I, is my is my max eighty three? Oh yeah, that's right. Oh, max oh. yeah. Okay, yeah. if your current sanity yeah. is still, then yeah, you're fine. I have, oh, I have you, I have incurred and, PTSD. And you are at current sanity. <laughs> Yeah. Have I been have I been doing that wrong? You might have been. I, I think you've been subtracting this instead of this one. So go ahead and uh make ten, change it up to fifty eight and we'll make your fifty eight the max for now. Because I I know I've lost sanity. Yeah, so you I should lose a lot. I, but you I should lose. not be at max though, is what I'm saying. Who's insane? Nobody's insane. We're we we stumbled back to our apartment, we're resting and we're gaining back some uh well, for yeah. the sake Much of things needed, to come, uh, help. And as, and as a reward for uh, for Sunday, we'll just say you start at max sanity this session. Oh, good. Which means we're going to lose a lot of it today. You mean when we go to the lighthouse arc? We're going to go to the lighthouse. You want to go to the lighthouse? Stop lighthouse. being twice as big as me. That's not cool. <laughs> <laughs> Some men are bigger than others. You're allowed to be bigger, but not twice as big. You are supposed to be taller. Like that's a good, that's a good approximation right. for how it should be. Right. Arc, no, I agree. Arc, I will, arc yeah. is like five foot three, and you're like six right. foot eight. 
or not. Well, that's what I'm saying. Look, look, look at the chair. I mean, I'm chair size. I'm perfect. Yeah. Big lighthouse. That key you had obtained. I never really yes. got describing what it looks like. Tell it me is all about it. an old brass key. Ooh. That is worn by very worn out, uh, possibly by salt water. Mm. I mean, being in a coastal town, that doesn't narrow it down necessarily, but it's you know. cold to the touch. Oh, brassy. Does it have any insignia on it or anything like that? No, but uh, when you observe it, you do feel a bit of unease. Something about it just seems off. Okay. But but it, no, no amount of inspection will uh, show anything other than the fact that it's a key. Okay. All right. Well, Ark, I, I do believe that there are plenty of tourists around. We should uh, mingle with them and uh, maybe take a second look at the lighthouse. Oh, I wish you would stop saying that word. Um, you want to go to that long, tall tower near the coast? Yeah. Want to go through that house that has a light in it? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I'd rather retire and. Uh, just, would you like to just th just go go back to a life of of not not going insane? Oh no, it's too late. Once you're in, you're in, man. Every time I try to get out, they pull me back in. Exactly. Yeah, I guess we probably should. I mean, we're not going to die just sitting here. We're going to have to go out and find it. Yeah. All right. Let's, I mean, let's you, march to our deaths. Yes. <laughs> you could die just sitting there if, if that's what it comes down to. Right. They died of old age just like they wanted. <laughs> yeah. Unfortunately, it was a celebrated old age. <laughs> yeah. So, lighthouse, right? You didn't want to stop anywhere else real quick? Um, I hate it when you ask that because it makes me think we've forgotten things. No. Well, why, don't, why don't we you stop You want to by stop to get goods. that really important item that you were supposed to pick up two dungeons ago, but you didn't know to grab? No, no, no. no. <laughs> it doesn't matter. It just... It's like, damn it. I'm the one that will stop you sure. from going insane as soon as you walk into the damn lighthouse. I'm just yeah. making sure you don't have any unfinished business, all right? <laughs> yeah, we got to make sure there's none of that. Don't want to go to the yeah. afterlife with unfinished business. Exactly. Now uh, let's 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 head over there. I'm going to write okay. a letter to my remaining relatives telling them I'm sorry I'm such an asshole. So <laughs> this is going to be weird for a second. I already got okay. you guys on the field, so don't worry about it. Uh, okay. Uh, there is definitely a lighthouse in the back. It did not just launch out into space. It's totally over here, guys. Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> I know that feeling. Sometimes TTS is just like and yeet, yeet. Definitely did not launch off into space. Nope, 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 nope. Perfect. Nope. No. Oh shit. Uh oh, it's sinking. It's in quicksand. It's a trap. There you go. Yay. It's off center. <laughs> that's that's erosion, man. It's erosion. Yeah, it's erosion. Fair enough. You're you're off center. There's Anyways. Also, there's also no light in it. <laughs> look, look. So it's a lighthouse look. with no lights. Look. It's a dark house. <laughs> oh, you have that whole bag full of light cubes I gave you. Come on. <laughs> Also, this one looks terrifying. This is, this is... Yes, this is why yes. I didn't want to come back. This is an yeah. obelisk of doom, not a lighthouse. This is what it looked like. Last time we were here, I, I looked into the sea and lost part of my mind. I'd rather not come back. Thank you. Uh, what if we brought uh, the big version of us? Would you feel better? Not really. Okay. All right. so, unless we can actually fire. physically kick, kick down this lighthouse. Right. So beyond that, you is the ocean. Obviously, this is the cliff that you looked over. Um, you notice that the mailbox uh, is emptied this time. After last time, you complained about the mailbox being. Yeah, I feel like we did a good thing. Just think of all the yeah. paid bills now. Um. So, is there uh, is there a locked 
door here. Is this, is this locked here? Yeah, there is, in fact, a door there. Uh, and underneath it is a keyhole. As, and, as and you find in a lot of doors. <laughs> Where are you going, Ark? <laughs> Any attempt to open I'm up the door. I'm trying to run away, damn it. Results in it being locked without unlocking it first. Correct. Um, I mean, it seems kind of rude to just jam your key in there. Why don't we give it a cursory knock? Okay. Kunk, kunk, kunk. A few moments go by. And then a few more. Hmm. And oh, you get well, no nobody home. Time to go. <laughs> and you get no response. All right. Um, throwing my key in the door. Okay. With a satisfying kuchunk, uh as you turn the key... This time uh, you're the leading door, the way. Obadiah. The door yeah, yeah, that's does you. open. Okay. And it opens up to a very not well kept together uh, lighthouse living area. Um, okay. The inside is drafty and dark. Uh, things are kind of tattered about. None of the furniture has been cleaned in who knows how long. Oh, and so it's like my pet, apartment. And yeah, and the cot that the lighthouse uh, keeper, like keeper, I should say, mm -hmm. um, the bed itself is stained uh, with some sort of blacky substance, or what is now a blacky substance. Mm hmm. Interesting. Uh, don't touch your hands. Did you bring... We should have stopped the store and got hand sanitizer. That's what we should have got. You know our PPE was in the other luggage. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Um, it appears that no one is uh, no one is at least on the bottom floor. And there are stairs towards the back that lead up into the lighthouse. All right. Well, let's... Uh, I mean, they have the high ground. I don't like this, but let's let's uh, let's head in there. I'll patrol outside. It, you know what? You do that, Ark. You do that. <laughs> no, okay. I'm coming in. Somebody's you were, gotta you, watch we, your back. You were you were fucking ride or die last episode. Now it's all. All right, we're going. We're going inside. Listen, you did not look into the sea and have the sea look back at you. All yeah, right. How, how how do you how do you feel right now? Honestly, scared as yeah. hell. What do you think? Right. Okay, no, I'm just I'm just wondering if you're feeling the same feeling. I don't know. Like you feel you feel like someone's watching us. You should ask the guy in the sky. <laughs> you feel like somebody's watching you. I don't want to. So let's just move okay. on and uh, okay. carry on. Yeah. All right, we're going inside. We're going inside. Hey, Blood Wolf, there you are. We're just Jeff. getting started, Blood. Don't worry. Conrad says so. You're annoying the GM, Ballsy. Thank you. Yeah. I mean, we just don't want. I just don't want you to end up like Wilbur. Well, Ark. You see the same thing that I described to Obadiah who looked in, mm. and you see the stairs in the back. The stairs themselves don't look really well kept together, mm. but think that if you step lightly enough, you shouldn't have too much of an issue to ascend. Yeah. Are you sure nothing in there has eyes and is staring back at me? Just checking. Uh -huh. <laughs> Do you want to know the answer to that question? No. <laughs> Then to the stairs you go. Okay. All right, let's uh, let's ascend the stairs. So you begin to ascend. It is a spiral staircase, as is pretty uh, common in lighthouses. It'd be uh, kind of weird if it was a straight stairway. That would be that would, be, that would, be, that would be really weird. <laughs> uh, and you ascend. Every bit of it, a little creaky floorboard here. Uh, shift. Uh, you hear the wailing of the wind and the and the crashing of the waves outside. And you finally get up to the top. And when you get up to the top, top there is a doorway that you would assume leads out to a landing that you then take up to get to the actual light part. Okay. This doorway is wooden and worn and definitely soaked with seawater. 
kind of weird for the top of a tower, isn't it? This close to the ocean? Maybe not. Maybe not? A lot of crashing waves, you think? Or do fish people secretly live behind this door? Only time will tell. All right. Um, what do you say, Eric? Do we want to bash the door down? We want to try and pick the lock? Is it locked? Do you, you try, try to open key? it? Okay, I'm sorry. Yeah, I mean, I didn't climb all those goddamn stairs with a cane to not open this door. Then open it. I'm opening the door. I okay. roll open door. I succeed. You, you roll the open door. <laughs> you do, in fact, succeed. Oh, no. Ark, I didn't, how, I didn't think we get the how, how close to Obadiah are you? Are you basically, like, a, within a few feet of him? What's the right answer? <laughs> yes, right on my ass. What is the uh, what is the right answer? Your hands are in my back pocket. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm 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 fairly close, but not like you know, just all up in his grill. Gotcha. Like the ebb of a wave, you are both pulled through the door, not Ooh. violently, but as if. You are compelled to do so. Oh, okay. And you find yourselves beyond the lighthouse. Yay! Uh, hell. Oh, of course, the damn lighthouse is still. Yeah. <laughs> and you are both. Another alternate dimension. Down here. We spend a lot of time in alternate dimensions. Oh my god. It's fine. It's fine. It's so upon fine. exiting the door, the door closes behind you and seals shut. But what you see is the top part of the lighthouse itself with the light shining out into what can only see, seem like a chasm at this point. Mm. Let me change something real quick. Because it didn't do it when I hit the button. Is it? Where are you? It's checking oh, the clock. Gun. Clock hasn't started yet. You're fine. <laughs> yeah. Oh, lies. There it is. Where is my... Yeah, there's my custom. And then I'd like to get to this. Of course, it logged me out. There you go. Where are you? There, is, dead. There, there is nothing beyond the table. The table yes, is I am, all. I am extra scared now. <laughs> there is nothing beyond the table. The table is all. What happened? I was going to say the file disappeared, but it's actually back. Got it now. You good? You got it? Yep, yep. <clears throat> I don't know. If you're putting in some other background, I'm almost of the opinion Ooh. the white was creeper. The white void is good enough. It's Ooh, creepier, it's but nice. uh, it's not bad. Nice little, nice little aquarium background. We're in the water. We're drowning. You're not in the water. Quick, Obadiah, stop breathing. There is no water. <laughs> just, just hold your breath. It's fine. <laughs> Quick, stop breathing. <laughs> uh, if you hit P, you go in the first person, you can look up. And what you see above you is exactly what you see right now. Oh, oh, okay. All right. Yeah, that's unusual including that spire behind you, you are surrounded by coral. But the coral itself is still fairly damp. Do I even see the seam in the graphic? No, no, you don't. <laughs> <laughs> are we in Cthulhu's fish tank? Is that what's happening? Arca... No.
Oh, let's go. To, let's all go to the lighthouse. Blood Wolf. Listen, fine. Blood Wolf like to make a let's roll. Let's all go to the lighthouse. <laughs> Dumbass. A roll of doom. There's no need for doom. We have plenty of doom already. Well, there it is, folks. <laughs> all right. Well, I, I feel like that was a setup. Blood Wolf fifty eight. Oops. Has spent ten thousand redemption for Wrath of the Game Master. Oh no. Okay. He he took all the sand away. Yeah. What just happened with all the bottom stuff? Oh no. Oh no. Oh yes. Oh, all there's right. one like floating. Okay. Listen. Uh, going into first person mode has completely broken my controls. So. Ah, ah, uh, hit space, hit space bar. Space, aha. Uh -huh. No. Okay, yeah, that's better. Thank you. Yeah. Um, okay. Um, before you do horrifically awful things, despite the fact that I pretty much knew we were going to meet horrifically awful things, um, I'm going gonna, gonna to run to the bathroom, so. Okay. Hey everybody, I'll as, as be right back. In the meanwhile, these two are going to have to keep you company. Garen, I'm so bad, he has to use the bathroom. All right. I went. I said it as completed. It will be done, Blood Wolf. I have it set up right over here. I feel like this was so set up. We've been it, hornswoggled. It wasn't set up. I just knew someone was going to do it. The yeah. man won't save you this time. <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Alright, where are they? I just gotta pull them out real quick. But yes, you're surrounded, uh, to kind of reiterate, you're surrounded by damp coral. And above you, you see a just a cosmic sky. There is no sun, but yet there is light. Mm hmm. And as you look above you, these barbed, what almost look kind of like tendrils sticking out, but yeah, they're pulsating. Mm -hmm. They appear to be alive, but they don't appear to be interested in your presence. Best to not touch them, I would imagine, regardless. Probably for the best. I mean, they do look huggable and all, but Hmm. Hmm. Uh, hmm. Thought I had it. What? What is uh? What does the area smell like? It smells like as if you're in the sea. Right. It's a very oceanic. Very oceanic. Very uh, intrusive. Actually, upon your senses. Yeah. Hmm. I don't believe this is any like any sea life I've ever seen before. Oh no. Does uh does the ship over here have a moniker on it? Does it have a uh a name of the vessel? Uh if it did, it had eroded away years ago. Gotcha. In fact, uh we'll get to it upon uh Aaron's rearrival. But oh, you would okay. notice this you would notice this as a naval Right, that's why uh, I asked, person. yeah. I didn't know if it had military markings or anything. There are there are beached ships broken all over the place, but they all appear to be from. They all appear to be different from possibly different. You see, you do notice some older ships, some ships that are recognizable for your time, and some ships that are strange, different. Some of them appear to be made of steel. Oh, that's that's interesting. That's very interesting. I've I've never seen a ship made of steel. I mean, you have, but like thick steel. Right. Hmm. There are there are parts that are recognizable as a naval officer, but there right. are parts that are like just weird, weird gizmos sticking off of them, things you've never seen before. Mm-hmm. Like uh, like weapons of some sort, like long shafts, like gun shafts, or yeah, okay. Uh, 
a lot of it corroded and rusted and some of it bent and some of it destroyed mm. you see cannons much like next to your character there but yeah. then you see what cannons but more aesthetically looking more uh I don't want to say the word because it'd give it away, but more. No, no, that's fine. That's fine. More sleek, I should yeah. say. More modern. More well, maybe not your modern. Right. Futuristic, perhaps. Perhaps. So something something dreamt about in the R and D department, but not yet on the open ocean. And then some. And a back. All right. Your picture's gone, by the way. That's true. Oh, you're back. No mind. <laughs> yeah, there's a little bit of a delay between what you see and what you hear. FYI. Yeah, <laughs> that, that's my bay. All right. So, what has Blood Wolf's wrath gotten us? Um, I actually struck a deal with Cthulhu while you were gone. We're cool. Oh, <laughs> we're cool now. <laughs> awesome. We're, we're Obi, besties. Obi, I knew you had it in you. I rolled. I rolled a double zero. Uh, so would you like to uh, kind of let him know what you're seeing that's so strange alright come come over here Hey, do you see all of these sunken vessels here yeah well yeah I mean uh, I guess there are, mo there are more that you do not see uh, yeah. modeled here but there are definitely a lot more mm -hmm. kind of scattered everywhere they're technically sunken I guess Despite yeah, well, that, that that's just it. We're 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 at the bottom of the ocean with no water. It would seem, which is strange, but maybe not the strangest thing we've run into this week. Um, <laughs> this these, week, yeah, yeah. These these ships are from different, either different places from the world or perhaps different eras of the world. Notice how they're all distinctly different from one another even though these two ships look identical <clears throat> Sorry, they only had like two or three models <laughs> I tell me but no finding ships is a problem that's why you've got a spaceship for an actual ship in Shadowrun <laughs> you just knock it off <laughs> the sweaty bantha is a beautiful ship and you will love her <laughs> <laughs> alright <laughs> fine Anyway, um, so they're, some, they're from completely different eras in time. Um, so yeah, some of them appear to be uh, ships I've never seen before, and I've spent a bit of time on sea and seen a lot of different ships. So either these are a nationality I'm not familiar with, or they're I don't know, maybe from some other world. Since apparently we're able to jump through loopholes in time and space, or the future, that, possible possible if you're gonna bend space time i suppose that's theoretically i be I, I don't know do i have the, the <laughs> intelligent aptitude to even theorize about that oh god there ah! <laughs> <laughs> i love it i love it well that that certainly is out of place that looks like an alien pleasure vessel i have no idea mm. what the hell but it's huge and it's, it's very up, clearly up. not from the same time period as these pretty sure it's, it's a barge but yeah <laughs> it's the ss well, Ar Ark wouldn't know so uh as i said obadiah you recognize them as naval vessels but mm -hmm. to your dismay they range from ancient vessels to like practically canoes all the right. way to just in almost seemingly impossible like you don't know how it could possibly even uh how such a huge metal tankard could actually float out of water yeah float on water here see like an old viking ship here you go there you go there you go <laughs> there you go <laughs> that's perfect doing a seesaw well, on the rocks that, that there's a drogger down here that's that's terrifying if, if whatever's down here took out the Vikings, we're in trouble. Um, Any of those long cylindrical things about 385 millimeters in inner diameter? Yeah, yes. right. 
Yes. In fact, yes. <laughs> um, everything's dilapidated to the point where there's probably no point in trying to loot or search them. <laughs> rusted. rusted uh, CJ, over, Harley Quinn has decided with... not to talk about the spaceship as a cruise ship today. Okay, that's fine. We'll save yeah. that for we'll save it for next week. It's everything's rusted, uh, broken down, have coral and barnacles growing off of them. Is it possible that we could climb onto the bridge of one of the more modern looking ships and have a look around for some sort of evidence of captain's log or maps or something like that, or would that all be completely disintegrated? Uh, well. Before you have a chance to do such a thing, uh -huh, then uh, here comes there, the pain. There's a particular thing I have to do. Oh, <laughs> oh no. Here we go. Upon <laughs> your awestruck just observation of all these uh -huh. different ships, and your mm. mind trying to wrap around what possibly these could be, almost immediately you hear what's the sloshing of almost like water That's and crawling good. out of the holes of some of these decrepit and dilapidated ships. Ah, uh, here we go. Fish people. Oh, I knew it. Fish people. Fish people. Oh, that's bad. Do these, do these look like the fish people that I experienced earlier on in my military career or is this something different these look like lamprey oh that's bad in oh. fact upon observation of them i want you both to roll a sanity roll that's oh, that's 100 percent. that's 100 percent accurate damn it okay <laughs> all right we're just we're just gonna roll some dice everything's gonna be fine oh damn i got an extreme success I got a 64. I did okay. Okay. So, both of you will only lose 1d10 sanity. Oh, only lose 1d10. Eh, it's fine. We got lots. We got lots. I only just got 1d10. <laughs> and I just lost most of it. <laughs> oh, this still leaves you uh, like 40 something. And, and to kind of answer your question that I kind of skirted over, uh, no, these don't quite look like the ones that you saw. Okay. And if if they were the ones that you saw, you probably wouldn't lose any sanity because you've seen them before. Well, that uh, wouldn't creep me less the fuck out because Conrad yeah. has asked if 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 they should mess with our sanity rolls. I I think we should give them the chance. I, if yeah, they I like mean, to, they just have to uh, do the thing. Every everything is legit. You know, you get a couple rolls per per game. So however you guys want to spend them. You could, you I, well, I guess the the negative rolls are for helping the DMs roll, not really. But you could make us re-roll if you wanted. They don't want that. They want to hurt me. Yeah, well, they they can they can spend that to make the mobs hit, add bad guys, et cetera, et cetera. Which one would it be actually for them? Um, what's that? Maybe would it be Game Master's Fortitude or... Yeah, Game Master's Fortitude will allow you to re-roll one of your bad rolls. So if you're trying to okay. beat the crap out of us and it, you know... Which one, which one will allow them to neg make you... Oh, it was it was either Fist Bump of Hermes or Pity of no Noholo AP or whatever? Yeah, yeah, that'll make well, us re-roll. Uh, that, that's the usually The Fist Bump of Hermes for just uh, flips an unsuccessful die to the minimum Two number success. for success. So that's a helpful one. Yeah. The other uh, one is the re -roll. No Hill P is take all dice that didn't succeed, re-roll them, and accept your new yeah. fate. So, yeah, so that wouldn't really mess it, with our die roll. No, uh, it's all the ones that didn't succeed, so you can't yeah. can't take successes away. Yeah. <clears throat> yep. But there's ones for the for the game master, so you can increase his rolls. Yeah. If the game master does a a bad roll, you guys can help him out. Yep. Um, or you can help us out and be yeah. cool. Yeah, a little ex machina would su sure be super yeah. helpful. Yeah. Especially right now when we're about to face sanity draining awful fish things. Um, my friend, it appears that uh, we're back into the fray. Yes, you are. 
I take it they're not interested in talking. I don't know if they have mouths for talking. I think they only have mouths. They are. For they appear slithering. to only have mouths. Yeah, yeah. Slithering towards you. All right, that's enough. Bang, bang time. All right. Bang, bang. Who, who you banging? Who we banging? Who's uh, these guys banging? I am going to dipsy doodle to the side of this uh, thorn tree and bang, bang that one. Bang, bang that one. The, All one, right. the one nearest to us. Uh, let's use my handgun, of course, because it has the best. Oh, damn you. That would have been a success, and then it rolled from a one to a nine. Ouch. Literally the worst possible. I missed like crazy. Whee! Another. Which one did you shoot at, Ark? So unnerved by what I saw. Unless someone wants to make me redo my roll, that'd be great. <laughs> or, or flip the nine to the minimum number for a success, which would be a six. That's a fist bump. <laughs> begging chat for assistance i'm just which, saying which did, i'm just saying they yeah. asked about opportunities to jump in i'm, I'm just throwing options out that's all. <laughs> which one did you shoot at i shot at the one closest to us to you okay. and me okay the one on the right should we <laughs> there's one behind us by the way i just right. noticed i the one i'm looking at yeah why don't we I, they don't seem to be i don't think they're terribly fast we should probably work our way that way and then we can we can kind of you know 300 this shit here i was thinking that but uh uh there could be more coming from behind us i there don't could know be. Or... well we're gonna have to pick a side of this rock and do it uh either that or is this hole in this ship big enough for us to fit through we could fight from inside here and just like mm -hmm. bottleneck them at the door I i'd like to bottleneck them but i'd also like a point of escape keep in mind they came from there yeah Oh, they came from the ships. That's right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. then we should get the hell away from the ships. I, I'll, I'm also, I'll, I'll, I'll second yeah. your opinion. Let's hide behind this big rock. I right. hope, I'm hope gonna, they don't realize that we're behind it. I'm going to head they this way. They can't be back I... there. It's a big rock. Yeah. <laughs> Where'd that shotgun blast come from? I don't know, but I'm sure it came from this direction. <laughs> um. All right. I'm, I'm going to attempt to unload my shotgun in his face. Go for it. All right. Um, wow, what? Wow, holy shit, that is a critical. Um, that is the best yeah, possible it... roll. I, I, I make him go bye bye. <laughs> yeah, and there's no amount of dice I could roll that would not. Make him go. <laughs> I mean, it does, it does 46 plus two for damage. His body goes, <sighs> you just yeeted him out of here. Sweet. He's just gone. All right, good news. They're not bulletproof. As you long just as have you, to as hit like, them. You just have to hit them. Yeah, thanks. Oh, uh, yeah. All right. All right. I, oh, uh, man, you guys suck. They actively want to make things worse. Of course they do. They just mm. like our challenge rating to be high. Oh, don't worry. Those weren't the only things. If I, if I could draw your attention up to uh, the back after the ship over here yeah i i see your nonsense over here i just want the anxiety to stop that's all i'm asking <laughs> like, I, I get enough of it in my daily life i'm supposed to be relaxing uh this is fine this is fine probably fine it's okay it's it's like the beginning part of your vacation after this it's all easy going yeah, yeah i'm supposed to be on vacation Instead, I'm fighting fish things and rolling like hell, and the entirety of chat is hoping I die. No. Slither, slither. One All more right. turn, and they'll be uh, beset upon you. All right. Ark, you're up. Make me proud this time. Uh, I'll bang bang first and then retreat. Okay. <clears throat> oh, why bother? They're just going to have me reroll to fail. No, can't reroll to fail. All right, twenty-eight. That's a half success. That's a okay. lot of hit. That's a that, that's a hard success. Yeah, it is. Go ahead, roll your damage and add another d10. 
at another D10? Heckin' yeah. Don't question the DM. Roll them double dice. All right. <laughs> I'll take that away. I'll take it away. Two D10s plus two. Uh, nine plus two is eleven. Blood wolf. Eleven. All right. Let me go ahead and roll. No, we want you to grow, says Timaeus. Hardship yeah, builds character. Yes. <laughs> uh, yes. Which 100%. one were you aiming at? Blood Wolf, I expected your betrayal. It was the rest of them I did not expect to turn against us. Which one were you aiming at? Conrad, the left right? Harley Quinn, I am so disappointed in you. That's uh, fine. We're shooting, Does we're shooting this guy. Does it matter both, all of them? Yeah, that guy. I shot in two directions at once with the same pistol. Figure that, that out. That kind of matters. It, drew, it you hit it and it drops and rise to the ground. Uh, you think you got it, but you can't tell because it's still writhing. Okay. You want right. to retreat a little bit? Okay. I'm gonna retreat around the corner of this rock. Now right. they can't see me, so I'm not here. That's right. You don't exist anymore. I don't know where that shotgun blast came from. Yeah, that's the one we're gonna try and sh introduce to my shotgun one more time. Let's see if we can get really lucky a second time. No, not so much. It's still a hit, though. Okay. It is still a hit. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, I, I got a lot in guns. Blast. Um, so anyways, I started blasting. <laughs> so anyway, it started blasting. Um, I need another D6. All right. Wow, that's just looks itty bitty. Let's make that bigger. All right. Hop, but, uh... Oh. There you go. Sorry. No, no, you're fine. Hey, that ain't um, terrible. Yeah, middle 12, of the road for all of 13, them. 13, 14, 14 altogether. 14 altogether? Yeah. All right. It, too, hits the ground, injured, writhing, possibly right. dead. I'll also retreat a bit. Just a little bit. Okay. You do not see any more coming for you. The one behind you is basically a fucking puddle. But these two, uh, but these two, uh, their bodies are still present, uh, but they right. have begun to stop moving. All right. Um, this is kind of probably kind of a little gross, but I'd like to investigate what's left of the body. I was gonna shoot in one of the writhing ones again. Yeah, yeah. Go, 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 bang, bang. Go I kind of wanted to stop writhing. I agree. I agree. I'm concerned by how, how many gunshots we can let off before absolutely everything in the world no, is... I mean, it's probably too late. Ah, you missed. God, you missed miss a stationary target. So, Obadiah, upon expect inspection of the puddle... Yeah. I guess, um, would I roll, like, medicine or something to, like, dissect it, or, well... Sure, if you want to roll medicine. Yeah, I, I just... Well, my medicine is kind of 21. Shit, but... I was going to say, use your intelligence, man. Oh, can I just, can I roll intelligence? Am I intelligent? I have intimidate. You want to roll medicine? I was talking about your characteristics. You have 65 oh. intelligence. Ah! <laughs> Those numbers don't ever seem to come into it, so I don't know why they're there. Nope, never mind. Yep, I find nothing. He's not even looking at the puddle. He's actually looking at the... the... Thing dead as I poke it with a stick. It's dead. <laughs> it dead. Mark, dead. You, you believe that it's dead. All right, I'm gonna take another shot at Wrigley number one. All right. Try not to miss this time, and fail miserably. I'm just wasting bullets at this point. Can, can you go? Can you can you push the gun into its body? Before I'm you not pull the getting trigger? that close to those things. All right. Um, is the blood of the body like acidic or anything like that? Does it smell weird? Is it? It smells weird. Um, okay. You're th not sure if the puddle is its blood or something else. Okay. Uh, it all looks very alien to you. <laughs> all right. Well, that's fine. I'm gonna I'm gonna use my rifle and try and show Ark how it's done. Maybe. Yeah, like that. Like this Ark. Sorry, okay. it's, it's hard to stop shaking right now. Hey, listen, buddy, it's going to be okay. Okay, we are going to be okay. All right, this is all just a dream. Just a dream. All right, there's... Uh, Not anymore. 
Yeah, nine. Yeah. Oh no, I'm sorry. It's it's two d six. I I'm reading the whole totally damn thing. Um, sorry. I'll keep the five. Just roll another d six. Yeah. I did. It's just like no. <laughs> <laughs> well, Al. <laughs> All right. It's still a four. Yeah. <laughs> Could have just kept the other fucking dice. Okay. So, so that's nine plus four. And what are you putting into it? Uh, I'm using my rifle. Okay. And this one? Uh, yeah, that's fine. All right, you blast the hole through it. It's it, it stopped moving a while ago. Uh, it moved a little bit just then when the bullet ripped through it, but you'd think it might have been the kinetic force. He's sleeping now. <laughs> okay, well, the other one's still moving. Uh, the other, No, the other one stopped moving. They all, they, they all just had like a weird, as far as you can tell, had a weird death throw. Maybe they bleed out slower than people. I mean, then again, if you shoot a guy in the gut, he's gonna he's gonna roll around for a half hour before he dies. So, not not that not that we don't know anything about that. I'm just saying, I heard that that's what happens. So, um, you know, depends on the caliber and stuff. Anyway, Ark, um, should we should we climb the the cliff face and try and get some high ground to survey the area better, or is that too dangerous? You're asking me. I, I am, because I'm an old man. I'm an older man with a cane, um, but at the same time, I would love to be on top of this ship, like looking down at the. I would like the high ground, please. I would like all the high all right, ground. Go ahead. I was more interested in this building like structure over here. Okay. All right. Well, I have a rifle, so if I can get up there, I can I can look down and, and give you cover. All right. All right. Why don't you hang out here? And I'm gonna see if I I'm gonna ask the DM if I can actually climb my decrepit ass up top. Uh, what's your climb skill at? I've probably fucking zero. Twenty. Um, oh, it's twenty. It's twenty. That's roll. like pra it's practically a rock climber. Roll twenty. Roll a. Uh... Roll some d10s. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, oh, I fall. I need help. Yeah, I fall. I need help. You. <laughs> well, Chad isn't gonna help you. They hate us. As you're Don't grabbing at the coral rock face, uh, it crumbles in your hand and falls apart. Not in, in terms of it being dead, but rather it's too fragile to get right. a solid foothold on. Mm, fair enough. All uh, right, I guess, I guess that idea is not going to work, Ark. Uh, the, the structure seems too loosey-goosey. Somehow I knew it wasn't going to work. Let's proceed. It's all right, listen. I appreciate you letting me try my stupid ideas. That's that's the thing I love about you. Listen, um, it, I I am not going to crush your dreams, even if I don't believe in them. I support you one hundred percent. You're my friend. <laughs> that is what makes you a good friend. <laughs> what you see from this structure, <laughs> this structure is very makeshift, uh, made out of parts of, uh random ships as well as uh what could have been stone cargo at some point um it is long long abandoned and any remains that you find here are indiscernible hmm. Hmm. so that was a waste of time no no that's fine let's move some of these rocks around and see if there's anything left here I would like to see if I can find some hidden shit, sir. I suppose I can okay. roll for that. Go ahead. Yeah, yeah, you do that. You do the thing. I, wow. Nope. Wow. Nope. Yeah, we found nothing. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. We found nothing. All right. You do not find anything of value or import. Okay. I, mean, I guess it's not the worst thing either. Um, you see that there is a cavern that leads further on. That's pretty much the only option. Let's go. Uh, all right. Hmm. All right, go ahead, take your guys off of there as you're moving forward. All right. So I don't like this is this is like Monster Alley over here. I don't want to be over here. <laughs> it is a little it's, scary. It's. Bye. Oh, we 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 got 
There's a giant man with a shotgun here. there. It's fine. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Wil Wilbur's gonna protect us. It'll be There's fine. There's a giant man with a shotgun. You're fine. Uh, you guys would be. I guess it doesn't really matter. Doesn't really matter. He says you're gonna die anyway. Here, over here. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna take the scenic route that doesn't crash into everything. Dunk, dunk, dunk! I say they crash into everything. Good. Listen, fucking... I'm just doing parkour, okay? It's, it's my thing. Fine. Boop. Um. Do these do these tendril things seem to be um, soft, pliable? Other than the barbs that are on them, yes. Yeah, they seem fleshy, organic, living. Right. Hmm. So they could literally lash out and cut us in half when they want. Well, I, I was I was thinking I had my cane sword, and I wonder if I should give my thrashing. But you the had same been time, walk, like... you had been walking by them previously, and they've been paying you no mind. Okay. So we should do them the same courtesy. That's fair. That's fair. All right. He says as he walks between two and is eaten instantly. <laughs> nom 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 nom. All your tentacle fears come true right now. Guys, you're not helping with the whole anxiety thing. No, no, you're fine. You're fine. Everything's going to be cool. Um... Is there anything uh, anything remarkable in this area here? Is there anything under this ship uh, here? Or there are more there? more uh, down uh, capsized ships. Uh, these ones uh, appear to be a mix between um, older, smaller vessels to what uh, can only be described as um, dinghies and life vessels. Right. Uh, not deep sea vessels, rather. Not that you've seen so far, no. Yeah. Or that you're keenly aware of. Gotcha. Um, are the are the cliff walls pretty sheer here? Yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of coral. It seems to be going uh, sloping downwards. This whole time, okay. you're walking on sand. Hardened sand. Okay. Hmm... Almost like you're walking through a desert in a way with a coral, like with but coral for the rocks. Right, a, a a dried sea. Yeah, yeah. That's moderately terrifying. Um, okay. Um, Ark, would would it make you feel better if I sang a sea shanty? <laughs> I think it would actually. <laughs> well, there's no sea. We can't sing without. A C. There's no C, so no shanty. <laughs> yeah, no, no shanty unless we define water. There's no C. Then, 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 then why did you offer? I just, I just, I just thought it might. Damn help it! I thought we were friends. If we survive this, I will, I will teach you a C shanty. Right, uh, just deal. very quickly, upon you see at the corner of your eye what looks to be dilapidated cargo, mm. uh, and attempts to deliberately tied down here. Yes. A desert shanty. But the but the crates see appear to be broken and rotted. Mm, should we check and see if there's anything of note inside? Absolutely. Uh upon immediate inspection, uh you can only guess what was uh what was probably once provisions is now rotted uh viscous Ooze. Oh, they used to serve this on Tuesdays on the ship. Yeah, it sounds like a French disc. Uh, <laughs> disc. <laughs> Rotted vicious ooze for Monsieur. Yeah, that does sound right. Mm. Nope. Wait, why are there dice rolling? You knocked nope. that off. I'm still blind oh. as a bat. I was trying to spot. Oh, who's you? Oh, okay. I thought it was Augie. I'm like, don't you fucking spring that trap? <laughs> no, no, you got 40 seconds left. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Uh, the timer's been running this whole time. Run, run, just get out, go. Uh, I'm leaving. Right. Bye. Yeet. Holy oh shit. <laughs> uh, <laughs> tastes like blood pudding. Oh, I'm gonna get open eye out there before he gets Thank you. lost to the void. Thank um, you. So. Fortunately, I pack it every time because if I don't, something gets. I know, I know. I have the same problem. Has up the whole thing. 
You're gonna be uh, on this side over here again, too, by the way. Okay. I mean, yeah, before we put everything down. Oh, no. Uh, just in time. Hooray, we escaped. You would hope that. No, we didn't. Yeah, I would hope that. What yes. the figgity yuck. So as you go through this cavernous, like, a canyon-like, really, uh, empty sea with coral walls, you come to what you think is a dead end, but in fact has a natural ramp that leads down into a dark pit. You cannot see what's below. You okay. you have basically hit what would be what many would consider a uh, uh I had the word for it. You know when you get too a far A giant on the stone penis? Yeah, giant stone penis, that's it. No. The which you had come across to, I should say, is uh what what is that thing they call like when you're in the water they don't want you going that far out because you can get grabbed by the tide or it's just deeper there um it gets a lot of people sometimes like if you go too far out undertow uh, undertow that's it but there's no water here a no no zone <laughs> yeah that's right yeah. <laughs> uh but you would think this happy time in my no no out. place you would think this is where the undertow would be. Mm -hmm. A drop off undertow, yeah. Okay. Um uh but you do hear the same kind of bloated water sloshing noise in the distance behind you. Mm-hmm. Let's keep moving. Um, Ark, let's let's be very, very quiet because this ramp may be used for things to come up, not necessarily just down. Do we have a choice? They're coming up from behind us anyway. Let's try not to discharge our guns if we don't have to, because, you know, death and all that. All right. Um, well, I'll keep my finger off the trigger. Okay. I mean, let's. I mean, if we got it, we got it. I'm just, just going to... <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God, he's dead. <laughs> The three stooges. Uh, I wish just perfect. I wish my I wish my base was as wide as yours. <laughs> yeah, I just face plant. Yeah, no, your shaft your shaft <laughs> is, is very thick at the base. That's that's Holy impressive. Shit. I was like I was like, yeah, but <laughs> that's fucking <laughs> fucking amazing. Okay. Alright, sorry, anyway. sorry. Oh no! The music has gotten more alarming. It has, hasn't it? Let me go ahead and adjust this real quick. Everybody's been saving those save our ass rolls. Now would be a good time. So you <laughs> They're descend. They're not gonna do it. They're not gonna do it. And you descend in darkness. And you keep going until you can't anymore. Until there is a sudden burst of light from two torches on either end of a doorway. seemingly beckoning you in. I mean, could it get worse than where we're at? I mean... Uh, I just lost it because it's just like, eh. Eh? Eh? There we go. There we go. Is this another goddamn bunker? Where? Why are there Nazi bunkers everywhere? Nazi bunkers everywhere. Flying out. Try to... I just gotta. I just gotta. Parkour. <laughs> uh, I almost got you. I almost got you up there. I almost got you up there. I almost got. Uh, you know what? I got a better idea. 
Just gonna, there we go. There we go. Oh, don't roll all that way, you might die. There you go. Until you come across what can only be described as ruins. Hey, so Obi. Sort of, yeah. You recognize these things, don't you? I do. Um. Don't get don't get too close to any of them. What if they all have keys in them? And what if those keys get us the fuck out of here? Um. I give is, up. Uh... I give up. Just just <laughs> commit all the suicide you want. It's fine. <laughs> Um, Ark, this appears to be some sort of temple. Yep, okay, that's great. Let's move on. All right. Um, you want to make our way down? Well, I uh, don't see any other option. Okay. We certainly can't go back up. Let's, uh, let's continue to be quiet. You see there... Uh, right here? Okay. Yeah, you see, you see there as you're kind of walking along that there is no railing or anything like that that would keep you from peering over the side or even falling in if you're not careful. Well, I'm um, an old man with a cane, so I'm gonna keep my damn distance. And uh, for whatever reason, and I don't know why. Oh, here we go. Maybe if I sink it. No. Huh. Okay. Well, anyways, at the bottom, uh, where the where the uh, where you the see it's open there. there, yeah, it's look like almost like water, but it almost looks like you're staring out into space. Oh. There's like stars and what looks like planets in it, but it very clearly is water. So if I look up at the sky, I see you ceiling. See, you see the ceiling of the t uh, area that you're in. So it is not a reflection of the sky. No. Fucking sweet! Jump in. Um, swan dive. <laughs> Where did Ark, Ark, Ark just fucked right off? He's like, I gotta go! Later, baby! I'm, I'm not sticking around, to, although it's weird that there's character sheet templates and Wilbur Smirnoff hanging out in here. That's right. Wait, what? <laughs> there he is. Oh, oh, oh it's, he's, it's, he's way it's over going there. all the way over there. Yeah. <laughs> it's yeah. going right through the building. Like, Wait, what is Wilbur doing? Yeah, I didn't put him here. What the fuck? So you come to uh, what looks to be a staircase, a spiral staircase. <laughs> let me out, let me out, let me out. <laughs> that will lead you downstairs, should you take it. I'm just uh, I'm just studying the architecture here. All right, oh. All right please. All right, please. Come here. And as you're going through, you see uh, very detailed symbols along the walls depicting ancient civilizations worshipping some unknown and terrifying god. Mm. Let's just go to the lighthouse. What could be the wrong with that? That's going to be fun. We're here. We're here to entertain people and die. So let's entertain people and die. Um, can I, I can, use the pages yeah, out of my journal to take some rubbings of these depictions, or are they not recesses? Uh, yeah, no, they are recesses. So you could definitely do that. Yeah, I'd like to. I'd like to do that and just take take some rubbings of what we as, got here. As you're doing that, uh, I would like you both to do a list check while you're doing it. So while I'm doing it, okay. So as I'm scraping the wall loudly. <laughs> Listen for something. I mean, it can't be worse than my spot. Oh, oh, Ark, I did good. Ark, I did good. I didn't. Do, 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 I do, missed yes, it by three points, which is the exact amount of luck I gained, so I'm not doing it. <laughs> All right. So, Obadiah, as you're, yeah. scra as you're kind of like... S Between scrape scrapes. Yeah. Well, while scraping, you hear a different sound of scraping coming from elsewhere you're not sure as the sound seems to echo off the walls but when you stop scraping that sound of scraping does not stop right 
We're not going to die down here. I'm taking these rubbings back to Arkham. <laughs> I'd love to take rubbings that no one will see because I'm going to die down here. <laughs> hey, better than I. Uh, yeah, yeah, did you yeah. did you catch those guys that broke into our temple? Yeah, can you? They're drawing on our fucking walls. I whipped his ass. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Um, the scraping I, echoes throughout the halls. It's faint for now, but it sounds like it's getting a little bit louder. Does it not sound fast, however. Right. I just like motion over to Ark to be like tap my ear and kind of point down the hallway like fucking coming. Someone's also rubbing down the hallway. I'm concerned for our health. Okay. I've been concerned for our health since we decided to come to the lighthouse, but whatever. <laughs> I guess now we can be worried about it. <laughs> uh... <laughs> Stop being a negative Nelson. <laughs> All right. Um, tell you what, what, we should we should be we should be strategic about this. Yes, we should um, totally split up because that's the smart thing to do. No, 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 we, no, we never split up. Okay, yeah, split up, gang. No, let's All just. All right, you take that one. Split. I'll go the other way. Sure. Yeah. No. No. I mean, we're we're going through. I'm watching. I'm watching this hallway over here while you peek up the stairs. That way, if somebody's coming, we can take them out. Because I would love to avoid gunfire if we can. All right, I peek down the hallway. Okay. And Go ahead. Yeah, Blood, Blood Wolf, that's exactly what I'm afraid of. I'm afraid Pyramid Head is just slowly dragging a sword down the hallway. Oh, for God's sake! <laughs> what did you roll? I missed, you? I missed spot hidden by one point. Well, spend a luck, man! No. He refuses. You do not see what it is, but you do see the silhouette of it uh, from your angle looking down the hall, swipe from left to right. Slowly. Uh, but you are look what you are looking across, though, isn't a hallway. It is, in fact, a bridge. Mm. Oh, okay. Leading into another chamber down there. But what you see over there goes from left to right. Okay. Hmm. We don't really know the layout of this catacomb. Do we want to follow, or do we want to wait for them to pace back and forth? Like, do we want to see their pattern? All guards have a pattern. They're not allowed to deviate it. I suggest we plant a bomb on the bridge. Yes. Wait for him to come back, and then make a noise, or wave at him. Hey, we're yep. over here! Come kill us! And then when he gets close enough, detonate the bomb. Then we just have to hide until their friends get tired of looking. Yeah. And then let's that, go back to it's the patrol. Per, it's a flawless plan. <laughs> that is how it works. Uh, let's just meet our deaths with uh, some semblance of, I don't know, courage. Okay. Yeah. As you head across the bridge, on your left and on your right, you see that same liquid that Obadiah looked down upon. And uh, I'm deliberately yeah. not looking at it. Okay. Jesus Christ, so what I... So I'm just laying down, it's fine, I'm cool. Uh, I'm just but it doing... looks like you're staring out into the cosmos, should you look down on the water. Nope. Oh, I'm definitely looking down. Nope. Nope. Huzzah! Alright. You don't see anything down this hallway, but you do hear scraping relatively nearby, uh, seemingly heading away from your position. Quick, we snuck past him. Let's get through this door. Okay, you want to get through the door? Sure. All right, I'm right behind you. You get the door this time. Last time I opened the door, you've been giving me sass ever since. All Fine. right, you get the door. I'll open the door. You can get me sucked into the next dimension. Maybe right, it'll be a keep... better dimension. Go ahead yes. and keep those guys there, because I'm sure you're going to have to double back through this way eventually. Oh, okay. Holy hell. Oh, Doctor. It's the Grand Library of Alexandria. Oh, hey, me. Wait, why is there a second me? Oh, God. 
Because I was trying to do you a favor and not have you drag that thing everywhere. <laughs> Well, no. Yes. Uh, same, same thing. You're not. You open up a door, and it leads to this bridge. And then that same water, it's caught more water, uh, is on either side of you. Is there something I can use to bar the door? Like, is there a lock mechanism on it or anything? No, but you can close it. I will definitely close it behind us. Yeah. Quietly. I'm sorry, there's any digital locket. Nope. Uh, upon here, you see <laughs> etchings. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Obi, you in a hurry much? It's Fox! Fox, 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 Fox! Fox! Oh my god, you should have seen it from my perspective, because I'm like in between the two statues staring into the library. That's the art there. I see just Obadiah just fly up behind him and he just goes flying into space. Oh, that was so ah. amazing. That was fucking amazing. Art, this oh looks like a god. crazy intense library. Some of the books are even floating. I see that, and I've never wanted to assuming, read Assuming you just charge in and ignore the writings on either statue, I'll just let you go right in. All right, that sounds good. <laughs> to all those who are book enthusiasts, that's what the that's what the statue said. <laughs> I'll read them. Okay. Okay. It is very difficult to read, as it is in a different language, but it seems to almost, in this place, spell it out to you in your mind. So as you're trying to read it, it's, you hear, not a voice, it was more or less your own inner voice. Yeah, the words get put into my head. Yeah, right. and uh, greed will consume you, is what it basically says. Greed will might, consume what if, you. What if I'm greedy for knowledge? Greed will consume you. No, that, that's greed too. We can't, we can't be greedy. But I, but I want all the books. What if I take most of the books? No, that's a bad idea. Green, greed will consume you. And the other side of it says... Uh, oh, God. I lost the page for it. Hold on. Uh -huh. It says, make sure you check the card catalog if you're looking for something specific. Right. <laughs> oh, they use we the use Dewey the Dewey Decimal, Decimal System, system here. <laughs> Oh, how old does that make us sound? <laughs> Is that no longer a thing? Okay, no, I don't... I, I, it, yeah, it's got to be gone. It's got to be, like, long gone. Well, it says, woe to thieves. Woe to thieves. Is it stealing knowledge if I put the book back but keep the brain parts? <laughs> you Shrug. must not read from the book. Haven't you seen the mummy? <laughs> <laughs> No, you must not read from the book! So, it says, greed will consume you, and woe to thieves. Yeah, no, that's fine. I mean, I'll return it. I mean, that sounds like they're threatening us with late fees. That's what that sounds like, if we don't return the books. I don't think it's a good idea to be here. This feels like a trap. Um, here, here, here. Will this, yeah. will this set your mind at ease? There you go. The music stopped. Oh, there you go. That sounds nicer. That's I don't the hear anything. Library soundtrack. The music just stopped. It, it builds slow. There it goes. It, it's much. It's much quieter than before. No kidding. Uh, I feel better. I feel better already. I would like to definitely. For whatever reason, through. yeah. For whatever reason, Arcane Library is always like really quiet. Yeah. Yeah. It just it just builds really slow before the loot comes in. Uh, but oh, yes. There it is. I can hear it yeah. now. You see many bookcases. And what's even more interesting is that you see many books piled around a table, uh, as well as scattered notes and what appears to be a journal. I would very much like to touch the journal. Don't okay. take anything. You can read. No, no, that's fine. You go what? ahead and go up to the journal. It's, a, it's okay. a plain journal, uh, but the front of it is uh, 
the Dutch word for journal. Okay. Or the German word for journal. Okay. You prefer. And what is that word, Augie? Oh my god, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just, I'm just kidding. Sucker! It's like, it's like torturing. Unless, oh, unless blood beats me to it. There's so many floating bookshelves up here, Augie. A book? A book. There are very many books. A lot of books. No, no, no. I mean, zoom all the way out. Like, all the way up. Okay. Are you all the way up here with me? Like, at the very peak? Yeah, like, like look straight down at the middle of the table and then zoom oh, yeah. all the way out. <laughs> yeah, I'm looking at it. There's a bunch of books up here. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, how do I get to the how do I get to the second floor? That would explain why so many of the books are floating cuz the, yeah. the bookshelves oh. that are supposed to be resting on are way up here. <laughs> uh, I'd like to get to the second floor. I'd like to read those books the most. You know what's funny? I don't see that. So hold on a second. Really? Uh, the clock was restarted, oh. by the way. We have 14 minutes until something bad happens. There it is. Yeah, now there it's all there, Augie. Now it's the Library of Alexandria. Oh, if, my God. If, I... if that place was horrifying. Yeah, I wanted, I, I wanted to meet the librarian. Um, yeah. The, those so... are the advanced books. <laughs> First, you have to study the levitation so you yeah, can float up yeah, there and read those books. Got to do this. So you got to do the spell, then you can read it. You wouldn't um, even you wouldn't even understand it until. Ark, how many books do you think we can carry? We're not taking anything. Woe to uh, thieves! Sounds like they're gonna something bad's gonna happen if you try and take a book out of here. They're just Great suggesting that you. you. Well, you have to make sure that you check the books out with the librarian. You can't just take them. I mean, I'm not a dick. I'm just saying we should check out. I'm sorry. Did, do you books. think the giant scrapey thing was the librarian? And we what just, if he is? We just didn't. We just didn't give him our library card. This is very clearly someone's collection of books, and if we steal them, then they will wrap our brains and cut them in half. I'm just saying you don't know until you. It would, if I had a library card, I'd totally show it to him. All, All right, right. Anyway, you know what? If you want to risk it, go right ahead. I will stand nope. here and watch your brain melt. No, no, no. I would like to read the journal. Let's see if we can read the journal. Very good. Okay. You open up the first entry, and it is in German, but you are German. Uh, go ahead and roll for your German. You fuck it. Let's see what we get here. Uh, no. Same, same terrible rolls we've had all game. So, you don't learn anything new or nothing improves, but you can still read it. Because do you want three... me to take a look at it? Yeah, you like. got better German than I do. No, I don't. It's actually worse. <laughs> well, you've managed to level yours up, and I haven't, so... Nope, nope, it's still bad. Between the wow. Two, we absolutely it's a, awful. It's not a success, but between the two of you, you can piece together what it says. The very first we entry... think. The very first entry starts with a number. Okay. One. Seven, 17... Yeah, one. <laughs> eight, three. 1783. Mm. And it reads as such. This is the first century. I am Anastas de Vries. And these may be my final words. It has been five years since the murder of my wife and daughter. I have spent it plotting revenge against those who dare bring their war to my doorstep. And take those whom I cherish dearly. In my studies I had come across a tome with a peculiar name. Its contents spoke of strange designs and incantations. I thought it just the ravings of a madman, but in my desperate curiosity, I took from it a ritual to open a portal to another world. To my dismay, it worked. I will use the knowledge of this hidden library to exact my revenge. I have found a text that speaks of summoning bliss to the world, ending all conflict it is as if something had heard my pleas and prayers. Among my search was a ritual that could prolong life. This will come in handy, as it will make time no longer a factor. Perfecting the ritual may take the most effort, 
the materials are difficult to openly collect. And the incantations appear to take a substantial amount of effort. I may need to seek additional help from like-minded individuals. That's the first entrance. Would you like to know more? <laughs> I'm taking the journal. <laughs> uh, I would, yes, I would like to know more. I would like to know all the things. 1861. I'm sorry. How, what year? 1861. Holy shit, that's a big jump. This guy is a lazy journal writer. The Americans are in the midst of civil unrest. I have been very busy, but I hope that it pays. It is very clear that the war is shortly to follow. I must start gathering reagents for the summoning ritual. Perhaps I may even convince others to assist me under the guise of offering an advantage for their respective side. 1865, May 9th, 1865. I could not prepare the ritual in time, and the Civil War is over. The initial preparations are laborious and time-consuming, and the reagents apparently need to be fresh. It requires perfect timing and planning. The world is so chaotic it is nearly impossible to predict when conflict will strike again. Perhaps a variable action could be taken. 1914, July 28th, 1914. It has been nearly 50 years, but I feel like I have never aged a day. I've kept myself busy. The world is on the brink of war once again, and my catalyst will be activated in a few days. This will be two final words. I will be seeing this ritual's completion myself. I have gathered numerous followers to assist me to assure my success. They say this will be the war to end all wars. They couldn't possibly know how true a statement that will be. There will be only bliss for my wife and daughter. And that's the final entry. How the hell did he decide to summon a bliss monster and give it to the Nazis? I mean, technically the Nazis haven't come into being yet. Oh, that's true. That's true. We're, we're pre pre Nazi Germany. Devries, nice. isn't, isn't that name familiar? Um, is that? Yeah, wasn't that the name of the guy, the commander who got away when we were those uh, German uh, uh, soldiers? Or not German? We were the just U.S. soldiers. We, but... we yeah, were British soldiers, right? If I, British soldiers. If I may draw your attention over here. Oh, in our pile of notes. Oh, yeah, yeah, there it is. There it is. I have taken the painstaking time to make sure that I don't have to remind you every time <laughs> who and what you know. Yeah. So yeah. he was the commander. He was okay. the commander who got away. You know, as, as somebody who enjoys books, I kind of feel like a dick for trashing his shit now. Why? I I mean, not that we trashed his shit. I mean, it was it was Jeffries that uh, you know Jeffries is a l lunatic with grenades, but you know, hmm. So he's the one that tried to launch the monster. Well, it succeeded at launching the monster, but if he it had been defeated back, yeah, it had been. But he got away. Yeah, he got away. He sees and clearly he's, he's trying clearly to resurrect it again. Clearly, yeah. And there's, there's clearly some age-altering things here because he's old as fuck. <laughs> I mean, I want to take all these books, but I know we can't. But it does not change my desire to take these books. I would like to at least take the journal. Okay. I mean, let's let's I, leave the library alone and whatever Elder God's I library suspect, this is. I highly suspect that there's a reason that all this stuff is still here. Yeah. And that if you try to take it, something bad is going to happen. I'll bet DeVries didn't even take it out of this room. Well, the journal's what he wrote. But yeah. I mean, yeah. But I mean, I, the, I the other books, like the ones around the table yeah. that look yeah, like I don't they might them. be important. Yeah. I don't, I don't think we should mess with those. But we can read them. We can read them. We can read them. How, how how's your arcane knowledge? You wanna you wanna learn some spells? I don't know. All I know is we literally don't have the time. 
We have less than six minutes until okay. something bad happens. I mean, I can look something up in the index of this first book that I pull. <laughs> I mean, we can always press our luck, but uh, I, I, do you think we have enough info to continue our investigation? Maybe we could I mean, come. Maybe we could come back. We do have the key to the lighthouse, after all. Oh, oh! Now you want to come back? Now he wants to come back, folks. All right, listen. <laughs> You're the one who Admit needs it. to make up a decision. Do you want to stay Admit and get fun. more knowledge, or do you want to take the hell off? No, I'm. I'm going to grab the journal, and we're going to go. You're going to try yeah. and go. I'm going to stand here and watch and see if your brain explodes. Okay, I'm going to grab the journal, and I'm going to. We're going to just push Ark slowly. <laughs> Hell no. Boobity. See, my brain's fine. And the, cl and the clock stops. <laughs> so, Obadiah, as yeah. soon as you pass this threshold right here, I knew it. You yeah, hear yeah, yeah. a voice in your head going, Well, that's not nice. Why are you taking that one? I quite enjoy that one. It's that's... new. Can I, can I check this book out? Is are you asking to check the book out as in like yeah, take? Yeah, yeah. Can I, can I, can I borrow this book in exchange for Ark's soul? <laughs> Son of a bitch! <laughs> it's a good book, Ark. Trust me, it's worth it. Uh, all right. You know what? I can't take it anymore. Go ahead and take the soul. <laughs> So, seemingly materializing out of the dark recess of uh, the library itself. I knew it. I knew it. Was All right. You know, a gentleman. So... Yeah. Quite well dressed for the 1920s time. Gun out and pointed. Ah, uh, easy, easy. He, easy. Goes, he, he raises one hand up and he goes, "Oh, no need." I can kill you with my thoughts. Just put your gun away. <laughs> I'm quite fascinated. Curious, even. Why have you come to my library? We are mostly lost as fuck. As was the last person here, but he seemed quite adamant in using my books for some interesting design. Yeah. The whole bending space-time thing seems a little above my knowledge grade, so I, I should probably leave those books alone for everyone's sake. Oh, he didn't get that from here if you're talking about his ability to live a long time. He oh, got okay. the Necronomicon, a book hate... I probably do not carry in my library. Oh, I was so hoping you had a as first edition. As I'd love to. If, if I can bring it to you, can I have a lifetime access pass to this library? <laughs> it doesn't work like that. Interesting deal. And he steps forward and goes, "Are you sincere?" I, I listen. I think I know where a copy is. And and if if I return that book, all I want is a library card and a, an access that doesn't involve worm people. I see. Ark, what are you... Did Obadiah, what... Did, I'd forgotten your name, for God's sake. I'm so shocked. What the I'm hell? I'm just saying... I'm just saying... I'm you willing do not to... make a deal with a dark god! You don't fight a dark god. We, listen, all we have is pistols. This guy has an arcane library of knowledge that could help us better humanity. I mean, it. I, I'm just that's, saying... That's probably what Mr. DeVries thinks. Yeah, well, he. I mean, the, the the bliss was. Listen, let's be honest. The bliss felt pretty good, right? Yeah, but we saw what the bliss thing did back in the war. Remember, the bliss thing might yeah. feel nice, but it doesn't end up nice. It's, oh, it's not good. It's not good. Yeah, no. He's gonna eat the whole world. Let's stop I... that, okay? During your yeah. whole argument, the gentleman there is literally just standing there with a Cheshire grin, just patiently waiting for you. And waiting for him to be able to continue. Please, by all means, sir. This is your library. We're goes, you're you're our host. He goes. I understand your, well, 
Reservations? A... Reservations. Blood yes. Wolf says always make a deal with a dark god. Yes! No, it's... I appreciate you considering me a dark god, but I'm a bit more complicated than that. Okay. Best describe is I'm more of a... I suppose you would consider me like in a librarian? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. God, a... Knowledge god. More of a higher title. A keeper. A keeper of arcane lore. Oh, that's my favorite type of keeper. There are many of us. We take on many different forms. Uh, in fact, I had taken upon myself to take upon this form uh, to help put you at ease. I see that it did not help. No, no, you don't listen. Of all the things we've seen today, this is my favorite thing so far. But your proposition <laughs> intrigues me. The Necronomicon yeah. is an extremely difficult book to get on, get one's hands on. Many Arcane Keeper wishes they had such a book in their library. Why? Why is it so hard to get our hands on? Like, why? It's. Why is it so elusive? The most, the best I can explain it to you that you can comprehend. It's a being all its own. It has its own wants, its own needs. You're saying the book itself is alive. Live, dead, doesn't describe it well enough to what it is. It 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 has a personality. Uh, no. Okay. It has. It is. Is the best way I can describe it. But it wants that you things. can comprehend. Oh, surely it wants things, and it's gladly gives in exchange. So, if you were going to put it in this library in a category, what category would you put it in? Put this library in a category. <laughs> yeah, I, I mean, is it, is it science fiction? Is it fiction? Is it religion? My good sir, it's everything. Yeah, I had a feeling you'd say that. So, I mean, would you want the book for bragging rights with the other keepers, or does it serve Such a different a tome. purpose? Certainly, well, as I understand how bragging rights goes, the best shortest answer i can give is well yes of course gotcha you're not gonna like summon some uber elder gods are you you wouldn't a nice gentleman like you and risk damage or loss of my library no of course yeah of course, i would of never course, put my i would never put my collection in such danger however such things are more or less out of my hands anyway so should okay. the time ever come, it's not really much I can do about it. So I wouldn't be exactly uh, be willing to quicken that yeah. scenario. I mean, I, I would happen to have a cup of tea and discuss this library with you endlessly. Uh, but I have a feeling you have a point you were looking to make. Yes. So that journal you're taking with you... Yes. Days. Is... Well... <laughs> It doesn't have to stay. If you're willing to get me that Necronomicon, I can I'm more certainly than willing, work I'm more than yeah. willing to part with so, what was not originally my own anyway. Well, I was going to say, that is not really a fair trace. <laughs> a journal with three entries in it for, for the Necronomicon? No, I want a, access a, a to the that library. We've already, that we've already but, read, by the way. Well, I believe that the deal was the journal and access to my library. Yes. That's a better deal. Yeah, like like quick access, not not go through the spiky tentacle area of dead ships and and, and, and crawling ones. These, these monsters, yeah. Is that what you went through to get here? Yeah, it was it was kind of crappy. Yeah, I, I'm. I, we are not fans. We're not fans. You know, that I feel like I feel like there's a better way to get here. All right. Well, I do not know much of what is outside beyond my library. Oh, but interesting. Uh, 
but you could create an entrance to this library from oh it wouldn't even be a thought and 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 then we could we could leave this library like now <laughs> hmm i suppose i could do that for you all right um again I... with the promise of returning the necronomicon to me that is quite the precious yeah item Collect i mean it. i yeah i i would be happy to to i i believe i know where there is a copy on my plane of existence really yeah i i, I have i have a sneaking suspicion that i know where it is was it taken from the, where are we i guess is the best question where the hell are we to answer that, I mean, does it have a name? Very... You know I mean? Oh, no, there is no name for it. And oh, okay. Where we are, uh, hard to explain. We'll leave it at that. Oh, no. okay, okay. All right. Well, I mean, if you can create a gateway from here to a, a place that we're familiar with. That, that only we have access to, I'd be happy to work on getting you the copy of the ne Necronomicon. I would enjoy that immensely. And in, in turn, you would have ease of access to my library. Of okay. course, I would ask that you keep such contents within my library. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. I come here, I read, I leave. Yes, yes. That seems like a fair trade. That does seem like a fair trade. Ark, don't you think that's a fair trade? Do what you want. Leave me out of it. Ark, this is going to be awesome. Your companion seems distressed. Well, I, no, I don't mean him any harm. Uh, it's fine. I've just been distressed all day and I can't really handle it anymore. Listen, you're, you're going to create an extra dimensional portal in our toilet and then I'm going to take him back and I'm going to rub his shoulders. Everything's going to be fine. All right. Well, I believe your kind tends to seal the deal with a handshake. I believe that is correct. Ark, shake this man's hand. It's your hey, deal, you shake. He puts his hand, right hand out and just with the same Cheshire grin and the same cat hungry eyes, just Listen, this deal is too right? it's too fucking good to pass up. I'm taking it. I shake his hand. You shake his hand. And it's like shaking another person's hand. <laughs> Except with more doom. Oh, you... You feel like you just shake your hand with the universe in a way. Ah, uh, that's as long as the universe has a sweet ass library like this, I don't even care. He goes, "We have a deal," and mm -hmm. to show and prove that I mean your companion will harm, I will return you to wherever you wish to be, back in your plane of existence. Yeah, our, you know what? Our apartment would be fine. Our carpet actually looks like a ritual summoning ring, anyway. How convenient. Yeah, indeed. And before you can even answer, you're there. <laughs> Fantastic. Aaron, everything's fine. Everything's fine. I made friends with a dark god. I made friends with a dark god. You made friends with a keeper of arcane lore. Yeah, I did. All we gotta do is plan a heist. Now it's like Shadowrun. And with that, we are done for... <laughs> Augie, remind me again what your official title as Game Master of this game is. Keeper of arcane lore. Yeah, I... Yes! Aaron, we're going to plan a heist. Next time on Dragon Ball Z. All right. I, I have to pack to go somewhere that doesn't fill me with anxiety and dread. So can we, can Aaron, we, I love can you. we wrap this up, please? 
<laughs> yes, we can. That is it for tonight. <laughs> Thank you all for watching. Thank you so much, everybody. Thank I hope you, you had a really good time. For participating, if you did. Yes. Thank you, Blood Wolf, for the 666 bits. A deal made with the beast. Things are going to get a little weird. Oh, yes, they are. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Ark. We're going to hang with the dark god. We're going to hang with the dark god. So let's see. Let's do a quick recap for everyone real quick. All right. You have gone to another plane of existence through yeah. the West. You have fought extra dimensional creatures that you're not even entirely sure that they're dead dead. Even as even the puddle, you're not sure. That's okay. As long as the puddle isn't coming towards me, I don't give a fuck. Okay. You went to a place that has different naval vessels from all points of history of yeah. your history, including the future. There are ships that you that exist in our modern time, right? That are there, rusted, decrepit, broken. Yeah, we broke space time to make a deal with the space library. Then you walked into a ancient ruins that has a guardian that you did not see. You managed to circumnavigate. Yes. By going the right way, by pure coincidence. Aaron, you get all that credit because you chose that route. And you, yeah, true. You, you, you guessed right right off the bat. And you came Yay! across ancient, I say ancient, and impossibly ancient arcane library that has every possible Cthulhu mythos book that you can think of and more. Guarded, well, by a keeper of arcane lore that Obadiah made a deal with to have access to should he return with the Necronomicon, which we know is somewhere stored in Arkham Library. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> that seems, you know what, I mean, if anybody knows me, that's, that's literally exactly how that would have gone down. <laughs> oh, for what? access to a library with all the knowledge in the world, 100%. the universe, and then some, yeah. it'll only cost you the one book that can destroy all of it. <laughs> yeah, no, I, hands down, I would do it and then some. Oh, that's awesome. That's awesome. I don't know. I don't. I, I hope I didn't derail your campaign, Augie. That's my only concern. That was not how I expected it to go. It never is. Welcome to DMing. But I am so excited that it did. I <laughs> good man. I'm excited too. I'm excited too. I honestly thought you guys were just gonna walk out without a book. That you were gonna take the warning and be like, nope. Like, no. Oh, you're no. Walking away with what was basically just a new addition to his library at that point. Right. So of right. course he was going to be like, Hey, yep. now if you would have took it and ran, I won't say what would have happened because <laughs> you, you, you might still try it at some point, but you would yeah. never have gotten out of there alive. No, no, it was very clear that we were outmatched and then some, uh, no, that was, that was phenomenal. I am endlessly excited. So, Every uh, so again, to reiterate, thank you all for watching so much. Thank you yeah, all for thank participating. You so much. I hope that you guys had as much fun as we did with this. Uh, yes. We definitely will be continuing on uh, a whole new story now, depending on what they plan on doing from here on out. Who knows? They might be able to use this library to their advantage to take on a Nasus de Vries and maybe undo yeah. the ritual he is still attempting to do. Yeah, I'm I'm am a tenth level speed reader, so I'm gonna whip his ass. I'm gonna catch up to him in no time, even though he's been reading for like two hundred years or whatever. I mean, fucking what a. this means for Ark, however, is going to be an interesting uh, dilemma. I'm gonna hug Aaron and tell him everything's gonna be okay. Not even Ark, just gonna hug Aaron. <laughs> Aaron, I'm on my way over to your house. I'm gonna give you a hug, buddy. It's gonna be okay. Whatever, man. I was on edge through that whole conversation, and now I've got a headache. I just, I'm, I'm, I'm out. I'm out. I'm. All right. Ark is gonna retire and live with his parents in Iowa. He's done. 
He's just gonna just gonna take care of them for the rest of his life, however short that might be, when the world comes to an end. <laughs> uh, thank you so much, everybody. Have a great night. Yeah. Oh. I just lost complete control of my computer. Oh, you uh, what now? Did literally everything just? I don't know what the hell happened, but something happened. It ends when I say it ends. <laughs> That's right. Let me see if I can figure out how to stop the stream. <laughs> First time Good night, everybody. Be able to see OBS. So Good night, sort of, I guess. We might be here oh. forever. <laughs> OBS I... is like, I'll tell you when you're ending the stream. <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm just gonna I'm just gonna power down my computer. Good night, everybody. <laughs> Good night. Good night, everyone. <laughs> Good night. Hopefully it ends the stream. Bye-bye.